In the Middle Ages, there was once a wild youth who was heir to the Lambton Castle, which is near the village of Penshaw in County Durham. He went fishing in the River Weir one Sunday and caught a strange looking worm. On his way home, he threw it into a well by the castle and forgot it. As he grew up, he changed his wild ways and eventually joined a crusade to the Holy Land. During his absence, the worm grew to an enormous size and wriggled out of the well. It soon began to ravage the district, killing man and beast, and each night it slept coiled three times around Lambton Hill, which is now called Worm Hill. Attempts were made to slay the monster, but whenever it was cut in two, the halves merely joined up again. Seven years later, the Lord of Lambton's son returned. He was stricken with remorse at the result of his youthful folly. So he asked a witch what would be the best way of tackling the monster. She told him to cover his armor with razors and then fight the worm in the middle of the river. The price of counsel was that he should kill the first creature to greet him after his victory. The plan was successful, for when the worm wrapped itself around the night, the razors cut it into pieces, which were swept away by the river before they could join together. But when he signaled to his father on his bugle, the old man forgot to release a greyhound as arranged and ran to the river himself. The son refused to kill his father, so the witch put a curse on the family. In fact, from that day, many Lamptons died violently, some in tragic accidents and others in battle. 